all right y'all so i'm officially about to go ahead and do the chop it's been a long time coming but you know it's something that i've been uh, wanting to do for a minute now i was just kind of dreading the process but i woke up this morning i knew it was time to go ahead and get it you know out the way so um as you can see just <laughs> i'll show you all the end results of this i'm just uh cutting out piece by piece and i'm gonna comb the rest out put some conditioner on it you know get that combed out and uh show you all how it's looking when it's all said and done as I was taking my hair out, I didn't even realize the size of my hair was ate up so bad. It's like I, I um, looked at it a couple times and I saw that it wasn't growing back like it usually do. But I didn't think nothing of it until, until just now, until I took a look in the mirror for real, for real and checked out the size. I'm like, dang. And that's really from the um, lupus and stuff like that. Uh, it kind of will leave patches in your head sometimes. So, but we're going to get this right. We ain't going, you know, ain't going to worry too much on that and figure out where there's a will, there's a way. And after that was all said and done, you know I had to pull up and get a cut. Now this is looking way better than it was, you know. Um, so I'm grateful for that. See how it's looking? I'm gonna tell y'all, she, she hooked that thing up. When I say she, she did that, she did that. Hold on. You feel me? I look like a clean potato. But eventually get that back right. I'm trying to roll the sides out. Cause I had like a high top afro, high top dreads for the longest. I want my hair growing out on the side, so. I might have to probably tempt that up, but other than that, I'm really, I, I really love it. I'm loving this journey that I'm about to go on, just taking care of my hair. That's that's one of the biggest things for me. I wasn't taking care of my hair. I wasn't doing what I needed to do with the free forms and stuff like that, and <clears throat> I was just letting it go. Not saying that everybody do that and that you got to do that. Like I could have easily, you know, um, start taking care of it better, but it just got to do whatever y'all feel is best for you at the end of the day. All right, y'all, so this is a little bit of the stuff that I've been using for my hair. I have the rosemary oil shampoo and conditioner, even a spray on oil for my uh, locks at the time. But I'm still using it because I love the smell, I love the bottle, and everything about it. So for now, these are the things that I'm using. I do water as well, spray on, like I have a spray bottle for water. And I have some mousse in for my uh, for my braids and stuff. Other than that, this is what I that's my routine, and I'm gonna keep on uh, giving y'all updates on what works and what doesn't work well for my hair and stuff. So you gonna see. I'm gonna see y'all in the next video though. Much love, much light, much peace. Let's get it.